Hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Today is box day. Not just any box day. It is world's finest, the collection box day. And this theme is Dark Knight's Metal. Hold on. I gotta take the plastic off. As you can see, I haven't opened it yet. So let me do that first so that we can take a pee inside. Check out this box art here. You have the Dark Knight's Metal Batman right on the front and on the back we have the batman who laughs a fantastically designed and themed box i don't know what's in it let's find out together i'm just going to move my mic over here so that it's not on the table I probably sound different now all right opening it up and taking out the first item this is an article of clothing and i believe it is a shirt this is a sweatshirt. Now that, that is cool. I don't think I'm gonna try it on now on account of the fact that it's really hot in this basement, but Future Brad did have the foresight to take a picture of himself wearing it and travel back in time and insert it in this video. So much poo in this yard. <laughs> Jason hasn't done his duty. Come I'm forward. For yep. there. Forward. <laughs> no back. <laughs> You want me to go right where the poo is? Right where the poo is. That's where I'm going to stand. On the turf. <laughs> I just wanted to see how many times you'd step over it. Is that what you were doing? Okay, alright. As you can see, Future Brad is looking snazzalicious in this thing. Alright, what's next in the box? We have... Is this... This is the figure. It's upside down. It's the Batman who laughs. You know what? Here is what the figurine looks like. Here, let's just pop it in here up close. That's a fairly good representation of the Batman who laughs. All the basic details are there. He's very buckly. He's very gothic looking. He's got the yellow teeth, the big mouth, and the spikes around the eyes that also become the bat ears. All right, let's put him right here and reach into the box for the next item, which is, it's a bag. It's a shopping tote bag. It's got the same image as the box with the Batman on the front here from Dark Knight's Metal. It seems to be fairly sturdy. Like, I don't think it's gonna come apart. And this is actually really cool because where I come from, there's no more plastic bags, for example, in Walmart. You either have to buy a bag there or bring your own, and they're the reusable bags. So this is something I'll probably actually keep in the car for when I go to Walmart, or, ooh, no, this is perfect for when it's comic book day. Yes. What's next? We have, that's a sizable box. This is a sizable little box in here. So what exactly is it? Oh, it's a pint glass. A pint glass. Let's get this guy out. Go buy a box. Bye-bye, styrofoam. Oh, this one's different. Look at that. This is a black pint glass. Looking at this up close, I know for a fact this will not do well in your dishwasher. And yes, on the bottom it says, hand wash only, do not microwave, not dishwasher safe. That doesn't mean it's going to explode in the dishwasher. It just means that this front label here will peel off. So it's a fantastic looking mug. It seems to be of a pretty good quality. Just don't wash it in the dishwasher if you get one of these. OBKB, let's put that right here. And what is the next item in the box? This is, this is the badge, I can tell. I like the badges. The badges are one of the things that I like very much. Cool, we have, hold on, let me just take it out of the package. It's the Batman Who Laughs piece of artwork. I believe this was a variant cover for one of the issues. I really need to get myself a new denim jacket and stick all of my badges on the jacket so that I can actually wear them around and showcase them. Fantastic, thank you. And what's next in the box? Is it the last item? Okay, we have something here that I haven't looked at. And then we have two things. Are these the cards? Yeah, these are the cards. I'm gonna put that down that way. And then we, oh, we have more things. Oh goodness. Oh. That's the silicon pack. Don't eat that. And then we have something here. I'm going to put that there. I'm going to look at both of these 
I don't want to keep bending down and picking up the box. So here we have magnets. Magnets. And here we have a patch. Wow. Okay, hold on. I'm tickled to get these magnets. These are good fridge magnets. We have a group shot of the Batman Who Laughs and all of the first Bat variants that were introduced to us. We have another image with Wonder Woman, Batman, and Superman, as well as Perpetua's lightning-filled eyes in the background. And we get another group shot of the Batman Who Laughs with all of his other variant Batman characters. These are fantastic, and they're useful. I like it when I get useful items. Like those salt and pepper shakers, I still use them. And then here we have the patch. I'm gonna open that up for you too. Oh, this is fantastic. It's an iron-on patch. And you know what makes this extra swaggy? It's the fact that this looks like the kind of patch that someone who listened to heavy metal would have ironed on to his denim jacket, possibly sewn onto his leather jacket or something like that. This is like, this is giving me 80s vibes. This is awesome. So yeah, that's what we got in this quarter's box. We got the patch, we got the magnets, we got the badge, we got the pint glass, we got the tote bag, we got the sweater, and we got the miniature statuette figurine. Fantastic. I think that this is probably my favorite box to date. Yes, it is my favorite box to date because every item in here is something that I will definitely use. There's nothing in here that I think is like extra, just filler. This is a fantastic box. Well done, Culture Fly. Anyway, thanks for coming back and watching me open up this quarter's Culture Fly World's Finest, the collection box. It's really cool to know that you folks come back time after time just to see what I got on the inside. I know a lot of you buying these boxes really isn't your thing, but you do enjoy finding out what is in the box. So I feel like I'm a really good, happy medium. Like I'm doing a service to the DC community. Well, maybe not a service. Like a slightly entertaining, kind of annoying courtesy. No, not that either. I'll get back to you on that one. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.